told you about it. So what is Tapestry? So Tapestry is a new app coming to your app store in the next week or so that pays consumers for the data they're already giving away. Let me move Chuck out of the way. Our background specifically is in the mobility space. So we've been doing this for about a decade, specifically working with apps, primarily dating apps, travel apps, maps and weather navigation apps that you've been using on your iOS phone or your Android phone forever. We work with them to get anonymous data from those apps. Our job was to monetize that data and then pay them for it. So imagine a weather app, their core competency is showing you the local weather in your area. At the same time, they have to monetize that data somehow. Primarily, they're doing that with advertising as you're just opening up the app, you're seeing ads. But they also, many of them work with third parties like ourselves to monetize that data. And we've been doing that for quite a while. But for doing this for close to a decade now, we clearly saw an opportunity where the consumer was really not considered in the value chain. They, they should have been at the very top, but they turned out to be at the very bottom. Most of this data was monetized without our knowledge. It was buried deep in a term of service or a project policy that no one really reads. And that's where we saw the opportunity with Tapestry. Going to the average consumer and saying, it's your data, you should get paid for it. So how does Tapestry work? We'll talk about that. But with any business, if you're going to go after something, you kind of have a problem. And the problem we see is kind of couplefold. Uh, many of you guys have seen this, but I'll kind of rehash it for those who are new. The problem we see currently is that the data that's on your phone and my phone, the social apps, the search apps, the dating apps, the maps and weather navigation apps, monetize data without our knowledge or our awareness. You'll see on the right-hand side a couple of news clippings of how this actually works. So Facebook is, was launching a, a VPN app, which many of you guys use VPNs, that primarily was geared towards teens and that was monetizing their data. You see the government, the FTC, ordering Amazon and Facebook and even shopping companies to talk about what do you have on consumers. Even the government, it seems, doesn't even understand. You have the social delivery documentary, which you have not seen, you should see. It's on Netflix right now, which talks about if you're using a free product today, whether it be a search product or a social product, and it's not costing you anything, then you are likely the product. We are the product. We're getting ads showed to us that things we maybe want, things we can't afford or we don't need right now, just constantly following us until we ultimately buy it or just give up. Then you had politicians pushing big tech to pay some type of dividend like Alaska has, right? Alaska has a natural resource in the form of oil. Everyone benefits from it. California has a, a lot of tech companies. Why isn't California benefiting from that? Ultimately, the big search and social companies lobbied against it and nothing really happened there. And that's the opportunity for Tapestry. We're gonna go to the average consumer with a solution. That solution says it's your data, you should get paid for it. You can download an app that works passively in the background that monetizes the data that you're already giving away. So we're not looking for more information than a weather app, for example, our core business is background location data. Also, you can share this app inside the app as a user and get paid extra just for referring the app. So we're gonna go into detail to show you how it works. The consumer will eventually go to the Google Play Store, they go to the Apple App Store, download the app, we'll create an algorithmic earning score for that user. We'll show you that live demo today. And that goal is set for them. So you'll have the goal here and the monthly earning balance. So it's three quarters of the month, let's say, for example, that consumers earn $8, their goal is to earn 12. Also, we're trying to be transparent with everyone using the app, how many events we've collected, how many points of interest this person has visited, and also their earnings, all transparently. This app is launching literally in less than a week. So as soon as we get that final approval, which we're expecting next week, this app goes live for all you who've been patiently waiting to download it. You can download the app for free, doesn't cost the user anything. But for those who are a bit entrepreneurial, like many of the affiliates who are on this call right now, they can earn more. So they can earn more than just that dollar for referring the app. And I'll turn it over to Danny or Chuck to kind of talk about the affiliate program in detail and specifics. I'll turn it over to you, Danny and Chuck. All right, everyone. Thanks for being here this Friday. This is Danny Walker with Tapestry. And as Walter shared with you, 
The app is very simple to use. You download it, install on your phone, set up your account and start earning for the data that you're currently giving away to pretty much every app on your phone already. The cool part is for the first time, you'll be able to not only know what your data is worth, but be able to see what is collected. And we wanted to be able to share and make it so that anybody else who shares the app can also create some passive residual income simply by telling their friends, referring their friends to also start earning on their data as well. So any personal referrals, whether it be one or 10 or 100 or 1,000, in the United States, you will earn every, every 30 days that the app is live on somebody's phone. If you were the one who invited them through your referral link, you will earn a dollar commission every single month. So it's a recurring commission that is a free, it's a free program, free app, free for you to participate and invite your friends. But for those of you who wanna really increase your earnings and be able to earn on not only your personal referrals, but whoever they may turn around and tell about Tapestry, once they've installed the app, you'll earn on two tiers when you're an active affiliate. And all active affiliates do pay a $9.95 admin fee every month. But what we've done is anybody who wants to participate as an active affiliate starting now before the app launches, we have waived 12 months of affiliate fees. So you simply just activate for one, one time $9.95 and then we waive the next 12 months fees. And that, that, that promotion will end the day the app goes live. So it's an excellent promotion to take advantage of. And as I said, what happens is you as an, a tapestry affiliate, now not only do you earn on your data, you also earn on anybody you personally refer and anybody they tell about tapestry as well. So two tiers, there are no limits on how many people you can share this app with and no limits on how many people they can share the app with. If you wanna build a team, we also have the team builders bonus, which once you personally help 10 people become active affiliates, you're a super affiliate. And what happens then is in addition to getting paid for the data by installing the app and earning on tier one and two, you also earn a 50% check match bonus on all of your tier one and tier two active affiliates, every single one of them, what they earn in affiliate commissions that month, you will earn a 50% matching bonus in addition to your own affiliate commissions. And we will have a super affiliate pool. Any orphans, anybody who comes to Tapestry, finds it on the in the app store and without a referral link, will go into that pool and all those super affiliates will be divvied out those customers, Tapestry customers every single month. So in this example here, you may have 10 personal affiliates some might have a few affiliates under them as well that they have shared tapestry with that want to participate in the affiliate program. And you will earn a 50% check match on each affiliate on your tier one and each affiliate on your tier two every single month in addition to the affiliate commissions that you earn on your personal referrals and those that they refer. In this example, just this is just an earnings example. Uh, in the perfect world, let's say that you have your 10 affiliates who each earn $100 in affiliate commissions in a 30-day period, you would earn a $50 override bonus, super affiliate bonus on each one, which would be a, an extra $500 bonus in your pocket for that month. Ultimately, we're not making any income claims. There's no gotchas in this affiliate program. You can participate as much or as little as you like. We just wanted to be able to allow you to not only tap into earning on your own data, but also to help reward you because you're the one sharing tapestry with the world. We're launching in the United States initially, and then Walter's going to talk a little bit more about that, but I just wanted to make sure that everybody understands the opportunity here where we have the Founders Club membership, which you want to participate in. And ultimately, we have really all been duped into giving away our data. And Tapestry aims to turn that around, take that data, put, it, put the power back in your pocket, and put the money back in your pocket as well so that you're no longer giving away all this data to big tech for free. You are now earning on the value you're creating. And Tapestry is about transparency, and we do not collect what all the other apps 
collect. And I'm going to ask Walter to kind of share on that as well as he does the, I know you're going to do the app demo and uh, let people know, but we really just collect anonymous device location information. So where you carry your phone around in the world, that is the, the data that Tapestry taps into and pays you for. Walter, I'll turn it back over to you. Thanks, Danny, I appreciate that. All right, I'm gonna transition to my phone. Okay. All right, so hopefully, okay, perfect. Let's start with a weather app that we're all familiar with. I'm just using it as an example about, you know, what's kind of collected and, and how that's different from, let's say, any other app. So right now I've pulled up the Weather Channel app owned by IBM, a very, very popular app. I think roughly 300 million downloads of this app. You can see that location icon being pulled up right now, um, which is them pulling the, the weather in my local area. What do they have? Well, they have my exact location because this is coming from a satellite. This is GPS data. You know exactly where I'm located. They have the device ID of my phone. That is an, an advertising identifier. It's not my IMEI number. It's not my email address. It is a unique identifier. But with that identifier, they can then use that identifier on Facebook or on Google Ad Manager and retarget me things primarily based on my location and how the Weather Channel does it, which is pretty smart. They'll primarily serve ads to you that are based on your location. So it's summertime here in, in Naperville, Illinois, right outside of Chicago, and it's pretty hot outside. So maybe I'll get an ad on YouTube or Facebook relative to shorts or the beach or a, a vacation or something like that. And that will transition once it gets to the fall. So I, I definitely want to lay the groundwork to, to, just to let, tell everyone what we're collecting is not out of the ordinary. Also, let's kind of go to location settings. Hold on. Location. Let's go to privacy. And I'm just being fully transparent. You can see my phone, what I allow to collect my location and what is not allowed to collect my location. I'm in this industry, so I'm you know, very specific on what I allow to collect. And you'll see a lot of nevers while using. There's very, very few on always. But if I am going to allow an app on always, it's clearly going to be an app like Tapestry because it's paying me for it. So here you can see the app permissions Tapestry is looking for. We're looking for always on location, and we're also looking for precise location. That is the active ingredient to show how this app actually works. So with that said, let's go into the app. Let's get out of that. Let's go into Tapestry. Okay, so this is a splash screen, just the opening screen when the consumer actually opens up the app. I already have an account here, so there's no sign up process. Uh, I think on the next call we do, we'll probably walk through the full process of starting a, an account from scratch. But this is the home screen, probably the most important screen of the whole app where we begin creating that algorithmic goal for you. Just like that weather app, there's a location icon being ca captured. Now it's that red dot at the laptop left, that's the zoom, so it's blocking it, but that's where it would be. So this home screen, this is the screen you'd go to every day or once a week, whenever you decide to open up the app. It's running in the background. So whether you open the app or not, Tapestry is still collecting your location data anonymously. So the home screen. So every single month, let's say it's August 1st, you want to open up this app and you want to see the goal that we created for you. And the goal is to get that green bar to a full circle and get that monthly balance and get paid out. That's all baked in the app. You don't have to do anything. That's all there. For those who want to answer some questions, they would literally just click that button and it will pop open a whole host of survey questions that the consumer can answer as much as they like or as little as they like and earn more. There's also bonuses baked in inside the app if you stay active for 30 days. This is for the users or affiliates, doesn't matter who you are. Also, if you refer people, you can earn an extra bonus as well. Here, there's the settings. So we'll kind of talk about this in detail. For those, you know, dark mode is a pretty constant dominant thing right now. So if you want to be in dark mode, even during the day, you can toggle that switch and throw you in dark mode. And you can see how everything kind of goes dark. You can leave that. You can go to your account settings. If you want to update your email, update your password, or 
let's say you want to stop sharing location data with us for whatever reason. For whatever reason, you don't have to tell us. You can stop sharing location data, and that stops completely within the app. You also have the ability to delete that app as well. It's your data. It's your decision. It's really up to you. Also, you can go to payout to actually understand how we actually pay you out. That whole system is done through Stripe. You can see your payout history, how much we've actually paid you by month. Generally, this will be 12 months after that 12 month history that you can go into your affiliate back office if you're an affiliate to see how much you've been paid. Or if you're a user, you can look at your Stripe log to see how much you've been paid over the last year as well. You can learn more about Tapestry, which is that's there. Our privacy terms are all here. So you understand what we collect, how we collect it. There's a cookie notice there you can agree to. You know, we're trying to be as transparent as possible. Now, if you were to go to the weather app, by the way, and look at their privacy terms, read their terms of service, you'll see, and I, and I don't want to pick on IBM or the weather channel, any other app that's primarily taken on location data, you'll start seeing in fine print that these apps are now sharing your data with third parties, right? And it's that level of detail and specificity that kind of gives them the ability to share it. Now, if you're in Europe, and I think there's some people here in Europe on this call, that's a process with GDPR where they have to be very, very specific about where that data goes. We are basically pioneering a whole new industry here in the United States where we're going to tell you very transparently what we collect, how we collect it. And that's pretty important to us. You can also delete your account. So your data, your choice. We also want to know maybe why you want to delete the account. Maybe you, you have a duplicate account, which is going to happen a lot. We expect that. Let's say you get a new phone and somehow you start a new account from scratch, but everything is tied to an email and an account. So even if you get a new phone, you can re-download Tapestry and sign back in with your same credentials. You don't have to create another account. If you're not seeing any value from that app. We would definitely want to see that feedback. So Definitely type in you know, why you're not seeing any feedback. Maybe you're making too much money. Maybe you're not making enough money. Whatever it is, we want to know. Or you have a privacy concern. You know, We want to see that as well. We want that feedback. So you can say, never mind, keep my account, and you're totally good. Or you make the decision you want to delete your account. You click delete, and the data is gone. I'm not going to click delete here because if I did, this account would basically start over from scratch. So that's how it works. So we have the menu bar. But the next, and I think the one of the most important features of this app is our map. So this is me at my location at home. And you'll see that I have multiple tapestry accounts. This is my anonymous avatar. I can create as many avatars as I want. I can change it every single day if I choose. And I can do that here. So this is me, I'm Walter. My message to you guys is hi affiliates. Thanks for joining, we appreciate it. You can edit this message. So anytime anyone sees your avatar, you can basically describe whatever you want. So I'm in Chicago, like you said, go Cubs, go Cardinals, whatever I want in this message. Or I could change my avatar. So I can select a new avatar. Um, this guy looks pretty cool. And that's my new avatar. So the app is purposely very, very simple. We want all the work and all the heavy lifting to be within the app. But for those who are seeing tremendous value with this app, we encourage you to share it. And I'll show you how that's done. So it's tab a friend, earn a buck, famous sentence from Danny. You can literally refer this app by just clicking on that and you can then share it with any service you choose. So for me, I'm primarily using Slack all day long with work. Um, email is primarily the primary, most thing I use Skype and LinkedIn and then send that message. Um, and that message goes directly with my unique link. It's pretty cool and it's very, very transparent. And when I share it, I can refer another one and keep going as much as I like all inside the app. Let's see, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I missed here. The resetting of my location that's baked in. And again, we probably didn't say this in this call, but you know what we're collecting here is points of interest data. So we're not interested at all about where you live and your personal identifiable information, that's not our business. What I'm very interested in is that if I look at Chicago, for example, is around Chicago and every city that you live in or across the United States or across the world, there are people commuting into the city. 
you know, how many people are commuting into the city? How many people are trying that new restaurant that just opened up or flying domestically or internationally or, or going to Disneyland or, or, you know, feel comfortable doing whatever they choose? All of that anonymous data primarily tied to a business, a commercial business is what we're looking at. And I'll just do one more toggle here to show you how it looks uh, in dark mode. So for many people, they'll keep it like this. We think it looks pretty cool. It's all based inside the app. So that's it. It's very simple. Tapestry does all the heavy lifting for you. It runs in the background, completely anonymous. I can't wait to get this app in your hands. So I'll throw it back to you, Chuck, to, to open up to Q&A. Well, as we well open up q and I do want to, those of you watching this recording, get back with the person who invites you and uh, be sure and get set up as an affiliate as soon as possible as the app will probably launch by the time you watch this recording. We're coming soon. So thank you, Walter and Danny. Great job.